there's a thing called the nocebo effect, which is like when we use language like to protect your spine, you could damage your knees. This is a risky movement. You've probably heard of the placebo effect. The nocebo effect is the opposite. The nocebo effect happens when we have a negative outcome because we believe we'll have a negative outcome. So in other words, we are more likely to experience an adverse effect if we're worried about an adverse effect. So as teachers, we want to be aware of the impact of using that language, protect your back. If you do this or if you don't do this, you could damage X, Y, Z, or like this is a riskier movement. You want to aim to provide safety cues and guidance without creating a sense of danger or a sense of harm. So that's the nocebo effect.